There we go. So I'm going to do that standard double druid start again. The bottom path and then leave a little bit of lives for the attack speed. Yeah, climbing the ladder is mostly just like a time thing. Like the more games you put in with the right strategy, you just kind of naturally climb. Man, I don't even have my monkey ace down. What am I doing? Then I'm going to make him a bomber. I got the inferior ace side. I did. It's the coin flip. I'm going to get this wizard monkey going for round 12. I think I just saved for shimmer now. Attack's not viable till you get tag zone. That middle path ability is pretty strong. It can hold round 12 pretty well if you run village. But I do agree tag zone is, is very, very important. Sometimes in team comps, like other towers can compensate. Like boomerang is pretty good for mid to late game. Yeah, tag zone is pretty important. So I think I switched to Druid farming now, right? It's probably a good play. Games still go too long to not have two fives. Yeah. So I'm gonna just save for jungle bounty. I think I want that. You got the bottom path cannon, which is really, really good too. There's the jungle's bounty, nice. And then, now that I have this ability, I'm gonna blue Nico, probably to like 900. If we hit a thousand Nico, I'm gonna just pause on that. A thousand Nico is pretty nice. Yeah, definitely. Tag zone was really, really good. Especially season one, like that tag zone alchemist. That was like a, that was a crazy strategy. Cause he could pop lead and all that stuff too. All right, I'm gonna attempt a small push here. There we go. Ah, he's got the mob mauler. That's pretty solid. I think it makes it through though. 